Now to that confrontation at a neighborhood pool. Police say a man pulled a gun after a group of teens refused to leave. He claimed they were there after hours, but police say the teens were not breaking any rules. Ormond Beach police say it all happened last week in the village subdivision off South Nova Road and Willow Run. New 6's Lauren Korn has this story all new at 4.30. Ormond Beach police tell me those teens did everything right and say they didn't even realize he had a gun until that shot was fired. There no signs of any criminal activity. The kids were just enjoying the, the pool in the pool deck. Until police say 66-year-old Richard Marcel showed up on April 22nd at 9 p.m. trying to force the teens to leave, claiming the pool was closed. He is a member of the HOA, and the HOA did actually change the pool hours. However, they hadn't notified the Homeowners Association members yet or posted it. The teens, between 16 to 18 years old, confronted Marcel about the sign and refused to leave. That's when police say Marcel fired a shot into the ground. You can see the gun tucked behind his left hand here in photos from surveillance video. The, the video definitely shows him holding a, holding a handgun, you can see where it looks like the round fires off into the ground, and you can see where the dust from the ground kicks up at the same time. The teens were in shock, telling police they never saw the gun in the first place. The three subjects asked him, did you just fire a gun, and then proceeded to leave the area. The report shows Marcel responding, saying, quote, yes, I am putting my own life at risk. He's a godly man. He's a Christian man. Um, he actually, he mows my yard for free. Kelly Weeks is Marcel's neighbor and says he goes above and beyond, not just for her family, but others in the neighborhood. He's not the kind of person to have a gun um, and he's not the kind of person who would threaten children <laughs> regardless of with a gun or anything. Port Orange police arrested Marcel on a warrant Wednesday for three counts of aggravated assault with a deadly weapon. He has since bonded out of jail, but no one answered the door when we visited his home. I mean, anyone can ask someone to leave. You know, the method that he went about going to do it by you know, bringing a gun and actually firing around is totally unacceptable. In Ormond Beach, Lauren Corn getting results. News 6.